The Australian Science and Mathematics School is a senior secondary school that enrols students in year 10, 11 and 12. We're really looking for students who are um, interested in independent learning uh, and really passionate about science and maths. I think um, the difference to other schools would be like the open learning spaces, like you don't have classrooms. Um, it's open to enable collaborative learning. Um, it's ICT rich to ensure that learning is connected. When you first come here you think well, this doesn't seem like a school at all. It's flexible and interactive. Everyone was just really friendly so that was really good for first impression. The responsibility for everything you learn falls back to what you, know, you want to achieve. The learning style that we are aiming for for our students is what we call the self-directed learner. When I came to the school, I didn't really have an idea of what kind of learner I was. I didn't think that there actually was a learning style. I'm quite a visual learner, like I sort of need to see something to be able to understand it or have like a real world example related to it. I kind of synthesise the information. I think as well you can, it's reflected in my scrapbook grade. The scrapbook is a sort of a collation of um, all of the terms that we've covered in the course. It serves as um, sort of a way that a teacher can see how we've learnt things and how we're expressing them and what directions we might be taking. The curriculum design is very, very different. An inquiry-based, interdisciplinary curriculum. We feel that you have a much more authentic learning experience by not having to chop and change because it's time for geography or it's time for chemistry. You can look at a topic in depth between the two. So we're going for the big ideas, the big concepts. The way that we group students is different. We don't group them in year levels. Uh, we group them together, they learn together, they can learn from each other, they can learn at different levels and therefore the learning is personalised. There are many different learning activities, assessment activities, all of these are online. Sitting beside them are the resources. They may be textbooks, they may be online learning objects, they might be websites, films, videos, uh, all of that is available for to the students. The way that students can access their curriculum is uh, online, anytime, anywhere. Things I really love about working at the ASMS are the relationships between students and staff. The fact that there is no us and them at this school, it's just an us. Sort of like uni. Like you have you know, no uniform, you call your teachers by their first names and they're just treated like, you know, like more um, like adults. All their desks are like open, you know, you go to most schools and teachers' offices and desks will be like closed behind doors. It's like a, a good change, I think. We believe very strongly that uh, all the students have got their own individual capabilities and prior knowledge. It doesn't mean that every student's doing something different, but if there's an area of interest a student wants to follow, we can facilitate them going off in that direction. Uh, we do have um, around about 90% that go on to university and 75% um, of our graduates go into science and mathematics. At the ASMS we have a saying that if teachers are learning, students are learning. And the teacher's professional uh, development is underpins uh, the innovation that we have in the school. Tuesday afternoons are completely devoted to teacher professional development and then putting into implementation ways that we're going to improve some aspect of the school. We believe we're very unique and we know this because 
Well, just last year we had 1,600 international educators, national and also our local educators. And uh, they come to learn what we do. The school's charter uh, literally is to transform science and mathematics education. When you look at the world today, um, and you look at the problems that the world faces, uh, you can clearly see that it is people who've got science and technology and mathematical knowledge and skills that are going to be facing those problems and solving them. All of these issues um, are facing our young people and they are the ones that are going to be there to solve them. But at the same time they're turning away from science and maths. We really owe it to them to find a way to engage young people so that it will take on the skills necessary and the knowledge necessary to take on the challenges that face them. The ASMS has helped me get back on track with my learning. My goal is to become a pilot. It's more of a community, it's where our friends and our teachers are. There's heaps of good support from the teachers. They help you when they care about your learning. A hell of a lot of fun and a pretty big challenge. Everyone loves coming here. They help you when they care about your learning. It makes me care about it too.